Max on Surf by Mouse means the end of hot and click. It lets you go just about anywhere and do just about anything using only your mouse. With Surf by Mouse, you hold down the right mouse key and draw simple patterns on the screen that Maxon translates into commands. For example, moving the mouse up and to the right takes you to the next tab to the right. Up and to the left takes you to the first tab to the left. Notice how when you press the right mouse button, your mouse leaves a trail to confirm you made the right moves. A single line to the left is the same as going to the toolbar and clicking the backwards arrow, only a lot easier. Draw a line to the right, and what happens? You guessed it. You don't have to use the mouse gestures as they came installed with Maxon. Go ahead and left click on the menu button, and then open the options choice. On the new screen that opens up, choose Surf by Mouse. You'll see a list of mouse gestures and the actions they control. Some gestures come with uh, no action assigned to them. You can use those gestures for any of the Maxton's basic commands. We'll create a gesture to open up a find box that lets you do a search of what's on screen. We'll start with this unused gesture. It's uh, right and left, very simple. When I click it, you see that a box opens up showing all the actions that could be assigned to it. And there's fine. Click it, and it becomes assigned to it. Now let's try it out. Open up another screen, and do the gesture right and left. And there's the fine box. Doesn't get any easier than that. Uh, here's some, a few other things you ought to know about it. Let's go back to the options screen. There's one box there that's colored, and it lets you determine the color of the tail of the mouse. You hit edit, pick a color, and that's done. And also up here is a, a box uh, where you can check to enable or disable surfing by mouse. Although why anyone would disable it, I'll never know.